Okay, this is a quick guide to setting up Plex for Windows and the, and the Apple TV too. First of all, uh, you need to download the Plex software onto your PC or your Mac. So go to Google, type in Plex, downloads, and then you've got the option for Mac or for Windows. Uh, the Mac's a little bit different because the Mac's, Mac's version's actually got the media play on it, where the Windows version hasn't. Uh, it's just a server, basically, a media server. But, uh, click on that and download it. Uh, I'm not going to do that because I've already got it, but I'm sure we can work that bit out. Then once you've installed it, you should have a uh, Plex media server on your desktop there. Click on that and it'll open in the bottom of the taskbar here. So right click on that, Media Manager, it takes a few minutes to load, so I've already loaded all my media on there. Once it's loaded, you've got this Add Media to Library section here. So if you want to add a film, just click on that. Uh, it's called itself Movies, but you can call it anything you like. Then Add. Find wherever your media is. Uh, there's My Films. Add Folder, Select Folder. And then it's added there. You can keep doing that to however many folders you've got for movies. Add them all in there and then click uh, Add Section. Uh, I'm not going to do that because I've already got mine on. But then basically it will search through and it will find all these artwork and the summary if you click onto that. It shows you a little summary of the episode and stuff like that and tells you what format it's in sound wise and picture wise etc. But uh, that will pretty much do all that itself really, you just uh, let it run. It's going to take a while depending on how much stuff you've got. But once that's done, uh, flick over to your Apple TV. And, and then simply just go to Plex, server list, and you'll see me Plex Media Server option there, just select that and then all your stuff will be there. Uh, gives it you in this format, well if you click on it, kick me out for some reason, but uh, now you can see, I've lost this uh, once you go into it, that's probably not the best way of doing it, if you go to movies, say, click on anyone, then you get this proper view then, you can uh, It hasn't found stuff for but, uh, you generally get all your artwork, click on which one you want, brings up a summary, actors, directors. If you push down, it gives you all the actors, it tells you basically for that actor that's all the films on my hard drive that that actor's in. And you can obviously click on any of them and play them. Uh, director there as well. So all the films he's directed that are on my computer, click on it, go straight to it, gives you all the other information, tells you it's in 720, 5.1, DTS, pretty much everything you need to know. And that's about all you need to know for Plex. Hope that helps.